Hey, what's up guys? So today I'm gonna to start working on building the roof over our uh, patio back here. So first thing I need to do is figure out the height I want. I think I'm gonna put it up at nine feet. Um, and I'm gonna to try to remove one of these hardy planks. That way I can screw the ledger board straight to uh, the siding or straight to the sheathing underneath there and the studs. Okay, so in order for me to get the uh, roof height to be nine feet, looks like I'm going to have to cut one of these planks. Uh, so this is nine feet here. So I'm gonna have to remove this plank and then I'm going to have to cut this one down. So I'm just gonna get a level line on here and uh, just cut that off with the uh, skill saw and a hardy blade. All right, I finished cleaning the rest of the hardy board up and went ahead and got the ledger, the ledger board in place. Now I'm working on uh, getting these post brackets mounted in place and then I'm gonna cut the post to length and get those installed. All right, so it's the next morning, and I've got the ledger board up there in place, and I've got our posts and the beam in place. And I have these uh, posts sitting right on top of these little footings. So it should be supported pretty good. So now I just need to work on getting these rafters cut to size and laid out. and. Uh, and go ahead and start getting them up there. Get them. Fight.
So we've got all the rafters up there now. Had to do some creative framing over here in order to uh, attach this last rafter because I wanted to stop it short of this edge trim piece of Hardy. So I just put in this blocking, nailed it to the ledger, and um, I'm gonna put a long like four inch screw through this so it'll go through the Hardy and into uh, the studs behind there. And then I just have this rafter nailed from the outside in. And then that'll get covered by fascia, that gap. And I screwed up whenever I was laying out all of the rafter spacing. This side's right, but on, on that side I put the X on the wrong side. So the boards are an inch and a half off where they are right now. So luckily I haven't nailed all these down, so I'm just going to move these to that side of the line and then that'll square them up with the ledger board. Alright, so I just popped a line and now I just need to cut a bunch of pieces uh, for the blocking. Alright, got one row of blocking done. And gonna do one more row, but uh, we'll do that in the morning. All right, so it's next day. Got the rest of the blocking in place, so ready to get the sheathing on there now. Alright, I got just about all of the uh, sheathing up here. Now I just need to go through and cut all of the ends of the rafters to be plumb and to the same length.
All right, well, we got the roof dried in and we got the underlayment on there and it's ready to do the fascia and uh, we can do the metal. I'm going to do metal roofing on the top. So, but it's about to rain. It's going to rain tomorrow, so we wanted to get it um, weatherproof, dried in. And uh, next weather window, we'll get the roofing on there. Going to do a ceiling under here of some kind. I'm not really sure what yet. But I need to do some electrical work, add some junction boxes for a fan, maybe some lighting. And then we can get the ceiling up. Alright, well that's going to be it for this video guys. We'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.